back in the spirit of all things love and February and who loves anything more than Disney and Francine Brokaw, our entertainment correspondent is here with all things Disney and we're kicking off the 100th anniversary celebration of the Disney company. Francine, tell us how we're going to spend our Valentine's month with uh, all these wonderful people at Disneyland and other Disney locations. Well, thanks for having me. Uh, you know, I'm a big Disney fan. And this is the 100th anniversary, as you said, of the Disney company. Disneyland is kicking off the festivities for the year long event. And they've got special food, special attraction. Well, not a special attractions, but special decorations around special merchandise, of course. You know, Disney does really well with merchandise. And um, they're opening some new attraction. Well, not new, but uh, Toontown has been closed for a year. Oh. Complete remodel. Is they're opening that up. Is that in preparation of the anniversary? Well, they're just totally redoing it. They're making, uh, I can't explain in, in the short time we have, they just completely redone it. And it's going to be fabulous. It's going to be fabulous for families, for Couples strolling around. There's going to be a park area. It, it's it's just going to be fun. And then there's Mickey and Minnie's Runaway uh, Railroad, which is it's been in Florida and Walt Disney World, but they are now opening it up in Disneyland. And uh, I'm I'm going to be testing that out this week. So, That's so I'll have more on that later. But yeah, it it, sound, it looks looks so cute. It looks so cute. Well, it sounds like fun for everybody. And I know that they're kicking off these 100th anniversary celebrations with all kinds of activities and, mm -hmm. and some new fun nighttime things that people can enjoy. Tell us Absolutely. about Absolutely. Yes. Well, in um, Disney California Adventure, there's World of Color One, which is the nighttime light show. It's it's I've seen previews of it. It's just a tribute to Disney. It really is. It's wonderful. And then over in Disneyland, there's the um, Wondrous Journeys. I think that's it. Yeah, Wondrous Journeys. And that's also with uh, the, the fireworks that Disney does so well. And the projections on Main Street and on the Small World. And it, it's another celebration of Disney. And so, then during the year, is there is there more stuff that's going to be coming out during the year? What what should we be looking for? Well, Disney, uh, the movies that are coming out are also going to be paying a tribute to the history of of the company. Uh, we have, um, uh, let's see, The Little Mermaid, a live action version, which is going to be included with new music, a little bit different from the animated version. And on June 16th, Pixar's Elemental. Now that's gonna be a, a tribute to, to Pixar. And we know Disney and Pixar are very close. Um, let's see, I have a whole list here and I can't get through them all. Um, November 22nd, the Disney Wish. Okay, this is what I am looking forward to the most. It's an animated movie. And you know how um, a lot of the Disney movies, they have a wishing star, like Pinocchio has a star, or or um, uh, Peter Pan, the second star to the right. This is a celebration of all the Disney wishing stars. Oh my gosh. So I am so looking forward to that. That is going to be a fabulous, fabulous movie. And, you know, it just brings everything together in this in this wonderful year and especially on October 16th is the actual date of the 100th anniversary now they're keeping what they're going to do at Disneyland and all that a secret right now so I can't even hint about what's going on because nobody knows but I'm sure it's going to be really really spectacular I'm sure it's going to be fun for everyone and so we should definitely mark those dates and uh, <laughs> those are fabulous. That's a whole new set of ears for us. This, well, this one particularly isn't, but it's semi semi new. The new one from um from the Thunder's anniversary. I hope to grab grab one of those this week because they're gonna they're gonna go out really quickly. But yeah, they have a lot of new a lot of new merchandise. 
Well, so we're going to encourage our viewers to keep watching. And of course, throughout the year, I know you'll be coming back with more and more information mm -hmm. and stuff for us to actually go and do. So for right now, we're going to encourage our Good Day viewers to take advantage of this season of love and go take people you love and have the most wonderful time where other, where better than the happiest place on earth. So any Disney location will do. Good, good, uh, good segue. It is the happiest place on earth for me, especially. I just, I just enjoy all the, the fun and the magic and the memories. Well, we can't get enough of fun and magic in our lives right now. So Absolutely. I say, run, don't walk. Thank you. Thank you so much, Francine. It's always so much fun to have you. And we always love talking about Disney and I'll, maybe that'll get me out to California too. <laughs> no, you have to come. I mean, this is going to be a fabulous a fabulous year at Disneyland. I really will be. Do. I absolutely do. Thank you so much. And we'll look for you next time. Okay. Bye-bye. Okay.